good beat is literally heaven on earth. When you look good, you feel even better. Being a girl and girlhood is so beautiful. And I just love it. Like getting ready for a night out with your friends, doing your makeup, wearing a cute outfit. Guys will literally never know what that feels like. Because it's just not the same. No, the eyes are eating and I haven't finished the beat. Ah! All night at Urban K. They sent me this for the free ski. Big bottle. Yeah. No, the glam is true. <laughs> like, why is she devoured? Why is she chomped? Somebody told me I look like Victoria Monet the other day. I'm listening to Victoria Monet all right. They told me I look like Victoria Monet, but I think it's just because that Tori and Baddy really do that to you, you know? Dang, this is going to be a good makeup. Oh my gosh, I love this game. It's going to stay because it's urban decay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hey y'all, welcome welcome back to my channel. So today, well tonight, it is 8.38 p.m. and I'm about to get ready to go out, but I wanted to do kind of like my makeup routine and I'm doing like a full glam, so I just wanted to kind of record the process. So yeah, something too major. I just got my setup in front of my mirror now. I kind of want to move the mirror closer just because I really want to be able to see. Yeah, because my mirror sits kind of far back, so yeah, this is cool. And I got stuff in my eye, but I need to find my powder brush because I don't know where I put my powder brush for my makeup. So first I'm going to start off by doing my, just my regular skincare, what I would usually do. Good old reliable, I love me a little Vaseline on me. And I really try to lather my face in the um, sunscreen, I mean not the sunscreen, in the Vaseline because I like a like a moisturized face and my face is already naturally oily so I really don't know why I do that especially when I'm about to do like a beat because I don't really know if I'm going to do matte or if I'm going to do kind of like a dewy but I do want it to be kind of goldeny so I guess it should be alright like I, I want to look like like Mufasa <laughs> not to be like the antagonist but I'm wearing black and I feel like my lashes right now are kind of giving me like a cat eye moment which i really appreciate because i love a good cat eye and i'm gonna go on with this pump it right back nyx cosmetics it is a pumping serum plus a primer i do double prime especially for stuff like this because i'm gonna excuse me i'm gonna the hiccups because i'm gonna be out you can already see how my skin is like literally glistening and this is only one primer i put on the elf um, what is this? The Power Grip Pri Power Power Grip Primer Plus Niacinamide, and I would say like I heavily put this underneath my eyes and like my T zone and stuff like that, especially under my eyes, like I said, because I like for my concealer to really be flawless. Why are my primer dries? I'm gonna go in and do my eyebrows. This is the NYX Cosmetics um, Micro Brow Pencil. And I need my eyebrows done, so I'm gonna try to do my best with getting them as like sleek as possible. Cause as y'all see, like the eyebrows need to be done, but it's okay. And I use a brush to just kind of, um, brush it out and shape them, especially my front and my tails because I like them to be very precise. 
as, as precise as possible, actually. And I might put makeup on my forehead tonight, y'all. I do not be putting makeup on my forehead. So we'll see. And I go in with the brow pencil side. And I just lightly fill in the front. So that when I conceal them, they'll be like sharp. Like I just got my eyebrows threaded. And y'all, this is, I'm going to like, I think I kind of told y'all already where I'm going, but it's, um, I don't want to call it a rape, it's not really a rape, it's like a house music, dance music, I don't want to call it dance music because all music is dance music, but house music function, and I've been to one of the events before and the music is really good, so, you know, I'm very excited to be out with my home girl. And I don't know if I should make this like a vlog, like of the night, but I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to vlog, <laughs> to like adequately vlog the night. We'll see, I'll try my best though, I really will. Maybe this will be a vlog. Maybe it will be, I don't know. I do not know. And then I use the NYX Cosmetics Brow Glue for my brows, just to slip them down and really add to that shape that I like. I need to get some more of this actually. They need to send me some more because y'all know I am an ambassador. So. And the thing about it, like, I actually, the stuff that I promote, I actually use it. So, clearly, because it's almost gone. But I really like it. I really like to make sure my tops are as precise as possible because I don't like my eyebrows to look like wild. Like I don't, I wouldn't leave it like this. I need to smooth it over and give it a shape like that. That's how I like my brows. But nonetheless, I do make them done. So. Yeah. And then I kind of just like swipe them down so they stick. And now I'm gonna go in and conceal my brows with the LA Pro Girl concealer. This is like OG OG. And I use it on my brows because I like how I like this brush that they have on it. And it just makes it a lot easier. And I did not mean to get this much on this day one brush. I really just did not want to get this much concealer on here. And I'm gonna do my eyes first because I'm actually gonna do eyeshadow. So I'm gonna do my eyes first and then do my base. Just in case something messes up. I do not wanna have to wipe off my entire face. I dread that happening actually. So I do my eyes first. And then when I do my concealer, like I can clean up the eye part like here and here. Yeah, it's a whole thing. Um, and I like to get real close up when I'm doing my eyebrows so I have to use my mirror on here. to be a good makeup day y'all because why did my eyebrows why are they like literally eating this is going to be a good makeup day. oh my gosh i love this game yeah, what time is it it's 9 53 like low key a real a real day is going is running late i'm not gonna lie to you because they got some 9 30 honey I'm gonna do my best. And my clothes are in the dryer. And I have to pack my spinning night bag. <laughs> well, I already, I've been like packing it as I go along, so. That should be too bad. Y'all see the brows? She's, she's eating, yeah. And I like that I already have brows, so I don't have to. <laughs> so I don't have to go in and really like draw them on because I wouldn't, I don't think I'll be able to do that. I'm sorry. I'm not one of those girlies. I don't think I would be able to survive that. Um, I want to put some, I want to conceal the top of my brows too. So I might just actually do that. But I don't know if I want, I really just want to do the tails. Like the tail bands. I don't want to do the 
whole thing. Like that's OD. And then like, cause it's lighter. I don't want it to um be too ashy on my face. Alright, since I'm gonna put makeup on my forehead, I guess like it should be. Probably on the I guess. is like coarse and it's probably going to be even worse tomorrow because I'm going to be indulging in activities <sighs> I'm just I'm literally just a college girl and I love that for me though like I love being a college girl excuse me who wouldn't love that honestly and if you wouldn't like I mean, like, in comparison to men, okay, maybe I wouldn't want to be a college girl because, like, so much happens to women in college, so maybe I do take like that step. Not take that step, but I'm just saying, like, being a girl in girlhood is so beautiful, and I just love it. Like, getting ready for a night out with your friends, doing your makeup, wearing a cute outfit, guys will literally never know what that feels like, because it's just not the same. Okay, and I'm going in with my butter bronze, buttermilk bronzer by NYX. Um, and this is going to be like the base brown for my eyes because I do want to do like a gold shimmer, a very warm tone makeup look. Because like I said, I kind of want to go for like a feline cat kind of feel for tonight. And I already do like dark femish makeup but not like too dark but I feel like I get dark fan a little and I heard different other people so <laughs> yeah but I think it suits me so I'm not even mad at it and like I said this is the base so it's gonna be really light it's not even gonna be too much just the contour and get the feel and I'm really gonna be dragging everything out so I can sharpen it up and have that uh, cat eye feel for my eye I me, I like to look up close at stuff because I feel like I'm not close enough to the mirror but I need to be in the mirror I need to see everything see like what is this one why is it there Okay, this is what it's getting. I don't know if my camera is getting like what, but it's like, it's, I don't know what's going on with my camera now. Anyways, okay, we're here. I'm gonna go in, this is my Naked Urban Decay Metal Mania palette that they sent me. Love this palette actually. And I might use Decadent and like these two. Like I didn't know I had such a potent, um, gold in here but I'm gonna use studio which is like this browner color and I'm gonna go in and just kind of reiterate what I did with my contour but because it's an eyeshadow it's gonna be more pigmented and I really want it to be darker on the outsides to kind of get like that shadow and I do eye by eye like not eye by eye, step by step. I don't do eye by eye because I feel like I'm gonna, then I could be symmetrical. Camera was starting to overheat, like what the heck? Anyways, so I went in with the decadent, I mean with the studio. The decadent is the right now. Um, but I went in with that just a little. the contour is like the same color um 
Now I'm gonna go in with the darker brown at the end, road curl. And we're literally just gonna use like a little bit of this because this gonna stay because it's urban decay and they're it's very big too. So you see that already? Yeah. And for this, I'm just gonna tap it instead of brushing it so that I can get it placed like exactly where I want it to be. And again, I'm gonna be dragging it out so that when I do my when I do my concealer, I can cut crease the bottom. And then let the excess fall out as you not fall, but as you come to the front of your eye. So most of the darker shades should be on the outside of the eye. Look at my And I'm literally freestyling this based on how I've been my makeup before, so. I'm not sure if this before, so we shall see what she's going to be doing. But I have high hopes. And I might even add like literally just a dollop of black to enhance that ombre effect on the outside. Like literally just a little bit. But even the little goes such a long way. So it is really just about building the colors. I'm not just slapping the black on there. It's like what in the world. I feel like with makeup you really do have to just trust the process because for some people they probably be like, girl, like what are you doing? But honestly, I don't know yet. <laughs> and that's the beauty of it. At the end, it'll be bomb, so I don't care. And I think just like as a creative person in general, not worrying about how things are going to turn out and just doing it is really important. And if I'm going to have one, let's just start. Like, cool. Nobody really knows what they're doing. We're all just out here trying. This is what I have so far. Smoky eye. Smoky eye. And at the bottom, obviously, I'm going to do but we haven't gotten there yet. <coughs> I'm not sure if I want to add like the gold now, or if I kind of do like a teaser. This is my song though, so I have to be quiet for this and listen to my song. Y'all just gonna have to watch. <laughs> okay, so to fill y'all in a little bit, I use this Moon Dust Urban Decay palette that they also sent me. It's kind of messed up now, but I like the shimmer. I did Cosmic Spice Dust first as my first layer. And then I went in with the Metallic Mini, Mini at the Metal Mania. <laughs> Metal Mania and I did headbang and now I'm going in with the decadent in the inner corner. What am I saying? You guys can kind of see the shimmery eye look that I'm talking about. Yeah, she's cute so far. And I think the hint of gold is definitely gonna enhance it so it, it warms up the eye a little bit. And I'm really not putting any at the end, I'm really just putting it in the front of my eye. But letting the kind of ombre out to you. Yeah. This is kind of eating, guys. Maybe it's going to be more so before your eyes. I don't know. I think I'm going to do my eyeliner now, actually. Just so it's very crisp in my eye. And I'm just going to go with the heavy, the black. And do the inner corners of my eye. So this is the eye in my inner corner eye. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, psych, like, but I'm gonna go in with the the one. I'm actually gonna all night at Urban K. They sent me this for the free ski. Big bottle. <laughs> but for real though. I'm gonna spray. It's gonna stay because it's Urban Decay. My two favorite brands, Nick and Urban. Nick and Urban? Nick's and Urban. I'm gonna let this dry. I actually have a fan right here. But I had it for my camera because my camera was overheating, so. Somebody told me I look like Victoria Monet the other day. I'm listening to Victoria Monet, all right. They told me I look like Victoria Monet, but I think it's just because that Tori and Baddie really do that to you, you know? 
Victoria bag. And I also did some like a little tail of the eyeshadow, the black liner on the ends. No, the eyes are eating and I haven't even finished the beat. Ah! No, I love like very like makeup, you know. Anywho, I'm gonna go in with because I don't really want it to be too bright in the eyes. I'm gonna go with my elf. And I love elf too. Go with my elf. This is is this the one with the eye this? The hydrating candle concealer in the shade can neutral. And this is like a I'm gonna use neutral eye. I do still want it to be full coverage, but I just don't want, I don't like the concealer full, I mean, foundation full coverage, that's not really for me. Then I'm going to hit it with this e.l.f. same, same kind, but this is light sand, and I'm going to go in right in here, so that I can get the highlight in there. Y'all know what I'm doing. Why does my light keep turning off? Like, I really just don't have time for this. To be honest, I think it's over here. That's on my phone. Oh, uh, uh, does it turn off? I don't even know. I have no clue. Okay, anyways, we're back. I have two minutes on my drive from the clothes. Not too much though. And I'm really gonna blend these out like all over. Up a lot. 
versatility. Put my color back. So I'm not so pale. Cause I do not like being pale. Especially when like the camera be on. The, the camera be on. The cameras be on. And get that flashback. I don't like that. And I still gotta do powder, but my powder is a little bit um light, so I should be okay. Makeup will literally like just adult face paint. I'm gonna take out my nose ring so that I can do my contour. I'm gonna go like, concealer on the side that to the best of my ability. And see, I'm kind of leaving the spaces open for the contour. Yeah. And I'm gonna hit my upper lip too. Just bring this down. Bring it all down the line to the points where you want to highlight. I'm just gonna get all the way up there because me, I get in there. Every single part up to the temple needs to be covered. Okay, now I'm gonna go on this one. Now this is really gonna like turn me off. Like honestly, this is okay. I'm so bad. What am I gonna do? Yeah, this video might have to turn into a vlog because just to get ready with me is not getting ready ish, babe. And my camera is about to die. Anyways, going up with this butter melt, this contour palette. Not contour palette. The contour, babe. The contour. Just the contour. I do my chin. I'm trying to hurry up because I don't want my camera to die. But it's just going to work. I put this on my chin. Yeah, I really want us to be warm. She's calling me. Hello. Ella, is Naomi ready? Yeah. Ah! Oh, they're waiting on us. Yeah, I don't know if she's like ready, ready. She had her outfit on now. Oh, shit. She's like in her pregame nap. <laughs> exact. Where are all my wife clothes? Did you say exact? Exact. You be hanging around me too much. No, I've been saying that. You have never said exact. Yes, I do. I be typing it. I'll be saying it out loud. Oh, Lord. I be like, exact hellacies. You know this. I've said that to you. Um, I always thought that was like a Baltimore D&D thing. Um, maybe I got it. Okay. Basically, I had, um... I had just all I literally the only I'm quick enough and that's really like it was pissing me off. Um and then our oh, she's I love being a makeup girly like honestly let me turn this down. 
I love being a makeup girly down. Like honestly, you cannot tell me that this is not the this is not heaven on earth. A good beat is literally heaven on earth. When you look good, you feel even better. This is a Fenty Beauty. What is this? Hot cheeks. It's like a blush highlighter. <coughs> it is setting spray down my nose. And this is the color Fresh Peach. This is the one I majorly use, but they sent me three other ones or two other ones. But I like to use this as a base because it's not as like pigmented as I like my blush to be. So I just use it as a base for like a, a cute little highlight moment. Can't hurt, you know. You really gotta get in there because I'm not gonna let it on my chin too. I put blush on my chin too. That's just something I do. I feel like this coloring is like not, this lighting is like not working for you to really see how my makeup looks right now. And it's kind of pissing me off. Because it looks really good. So hopefully, when I do what? I need to get like a setup, like a real setup now. And get in my makeup bag. Because I just started getting into like buying makeup products. I've always liked doing makeup doing my makeup stuff like that but I just really got into um like buying makeup products and having like I actually once I started doing makeup content makeup brands just started sending me stuff and I'm like period I know that is right girl and I might even bring the blush up above the eye a little bit just a little and then I mix it with another black brand Julius Place Julius Palace it's a place with palace. You know black people be making up our own stuff. And this is really pigmented. Like you can see it on the brush. So I just use a really little bit of it to help the Fenty have some pigment. Now we're about to hit this um, mascara right at the bottom lashes. No, the glam is true. <laughs> like, why is she devoured? Why is she chomped? Okay, y'all, this is the final look. I think she's very tea. Let's get a close up though. Like, hello? No, but like, hello. Hi, how are you? I'm excited to go out. I'm about to leave out now. It's 10 06, so I should be there by like 10 15. Maybe, hopefully, sort of, kind of, we'll try. But yeah. That's what I'm looking like and I'm super excited to go 